Hi, I'm Daryl Cunningham and I'm talking from my home in England. This is the book I'm promoting today, Billionaires, The Lives of the Rich and Powerful. That's the cover. It's from Drawn and Quarterly and you can buy it today. Um, so what it's about, it's about the 1%, the richest people on the planet. Uh, it's divided into three sections and each one looks, focuses on a different billionaire. So uh, the first one is uh, on Rupert Murdoch. Uh, the second section is on the Koch brothers, who are like oil and gas billionaires. And the third section is on Jeff Bezos and Amazon. Don't take my word for it, it's good stuff. Uh, here's what GT, the National Affairs, the National Affairs Cor Correspondent of the Nation says about it from the blurb. On the back, if you want to know why the world is such a mess, Daryl Cunningham provides a gripping and necessary briefing. His graphic novel, Billionaires, is some of the best journalism I've ever read. Cunningham managed to distill a tremendous amount of essential facts about some of the most dangerous and destructive people on earth. That's what G here says. Now let me show you my workspace. Here's an image from the book. It's um, uh, from a book from a, uh, it's based on a, an image by James Gilray. Gilray. It was a 19th century cartoonist, and it shows a, my version of it is of faceless um, one percenters carving up the world for themselves. How I do my books is I do massive amounts of research. I read books like this, Dark Money by Jane Mayer, which is uh, a book about um, the Koch brothers and how they funded the Tea Party and the Republican Party to bend in, bend in politics to their own ends. And so I read tons and tons of stuff to know it all backwards and forwards. Loads of articles online from newspapers and magazines. And then I just get going and drawing. And I draw these days mostly digitally on an iPad with an Apple Pencil is the uh, UK cover of Billionaires. Slightly different colours but the same. Here's a, an image of the Tea Party. Here's uh, Rupert Murdoch in all his glory. So here's me drawing, doing a little drawing. I use Procreate. You can do all sorts of stuff with this. Do a little different colours. Yeah, you get the general idea. So how did I start cartooning? Well, I started originally in this sort of late 80s, publishing my own, self-publishing. So here's uh, Man in the Towers, it was the first little book that I put out. Uh, and you, as you can see here, that I was very influenced by uh, sort of wood block and liner cut work. So you get this very stark black and white, simple style. And that led me eventually to do this book, Psychiatric Tales, which is about, about my time working on an acute psychiatric ward in England. So this is a book basically about mental health. health. And that led in turn to Science Tales, which is like takes on sort of controversial science uh, subjects. And uh, that led on to Billionaires, which is of course about uh, 1%. So I get, became known basically as someone who t takes uh, very complex subjects and then boiling them down until um, uh, into a concise and simple way for anyone to to understand. So there's, there's a bit more of uh, billionaires. Have a look inside there. Oops. Billionaires. Out from Drawn and Quarterly now. Thank you very much.